Avoiding shopping scams used to be so simple. Watch out for pickpocketers. Don't send money online to strangers. If an email looks fake, it probably is. But in 2023, the scams are a lot more sophisticated than you may have realized. These are organized criminal gangs, often located overseas, who are very savvy at what they do. John Brio with the National Consumer League has been tracking really convincing websites, product reviews, shipping alerts, all fake. Basically, these aren't the same old Nigerian email scams. Just ask a former Nigerian scammer. It's just getting so sophisticated now. They are becoming smarter every day. Chris Maxwell, zooming in from the middle of the night in Nigeria, is a reformed scammer now consulting for the site socialcatfish.com. He says scammers aren't just looking for a quick payday these days. They want a gift that keeps on giving, just one of your major passwords, since so many of us reuse them across multiple accounts. Once you have access to the password, you have access to their social security number, you have access to their driver's license, you have access to your credit cards, you have access to their bank accounts. Very easy to do a lot of damage with information like that. So here are five quick tips to defend yourself against 2023's most dangerous thieves and hackers. Number one, don't reuse passwords. I know it's impossible to remember 300 different logins, but at least use different passwords for your bank and email. Consider using a secure password manager to make it all easier. And always use two-factor authentication for those really important accounts. Number two, look out for shipping scams. Get an email or text about a delayed delivery? Don't click, don't respond, don't call the number. To avoid a trap, get your updates from the retailer or the shipper's sites. Tip number three, you may think I'm nuts here, but update your software. About four in 10 Americans hammer that remind me later button when prompted to patch up vulnerabilities and it's music to hackers ears. Well, this is me reminding you later, update your phone and your software. Tip number four, pay with a credit card. They have much better protections than most of the new digital payments scammers prefer. Bitcoin, gift card, cash app, PayPal, Venmo, Zelle. If they ask you to pay a risky way, run away. You pay, pay the safest way. That's with a credit card for most people. And tip number five, beware of really convincing online websites you've never heard of. Even Black Friday deals have their limits. Listen to your gut. If it looks too good to be true, it probably is. With any luck, your vigilance will ensure some happy holidays. At least until those credit card bills roll in come January.